In today's video, I want to show you a basic tutorial on a DaVinci rendering and what are the best ways to render your footage. First of all, I'm making like five to seven videos per day on YouTube and I use it a lot. So I want to show you how we use it in the basic and how we can improve it. First, let's start with YouTube and go always with 1080. You don't really need 2160 because honestly guys no one is watching that everyone is clicking on a 720 and 1080 when we got that next thing is to format i would recommend go for the mp4 only because i prefer it codec is fine resolution the same 1900 it's all right frame rate i like it doesn't have such a big difference between between 24 and 30 so we can also stay on 24 and now quality i saw one guy i think i'm ready uh, with a really great point and from that moment i used that that you need to restrict uh to higher kilobytes only because youtube uh decompress your quality videos like facebook like if you would like to upload this video on facebook it would be destroyed like the quality would be so bad so you had to put it on like three thirty thousand or even forty thousand i would prefer if you go uh, upload it even on facebook make it 50. if it's on youtube 30 40 000. now encoding profile could be high keyframes it's okay advanced settings square okay date levels auto this is okay and now let's move to audio Opa, export audio codec okay date rate all right this is fine yeah you can also use date rate 380 if you want like try try to uh date rate go with the 380 and i don't know what was the basic 180 maybe try it out because the bigger the audio should be better 380 is like maximum all right big dev and file this is it like where do you want to put it so let's say that i want to browse it and i want to put it on my desktop save and now you can also do individual clips or a single clip like it will be the whole or you can just click here if you've got many clips and that's about it now you can also rename it Hmm. number one add to render queue and now right now it's not rendering yet all right you need to start render to become rendered now let's go on a vimeo because this is a little bit different i have it on a different because when you are um, uploading on vimeo you need to go high quality because vimeo is uh for people who are up, like uploading really high quality stuff there so go with, go with 2160 with video again mp4 ultra hd this is really important also go with the ultra hd boy restrict it go with the 40000 and everything is the same now but even more let's go even further what if you want to make the video so great that you want it to be epic like you got a drone footage uh, of a mountain and you want to be in really great quality so we need to make it different and i will show you now how in the custom you need to go and change the codec i would recommend to go pro sign form and go with the u 10 bit or even 16 it's also up to you but I'm using 10 bit. Now Ultra HD, it's up to you, like the resolution you want to do. Frame rate, I would go with a 30. Also try it out, like it's file name. Let's go, add to render queue, and you can see it here. Then you would click just start render, and voila, you got it. And you can create as many videos as you desire. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, see you in the next one. 
And yep, you can subscribe if you want, but it's completely up to you, my friends. Goodbye.